Hmm, how to create a 3D illusion picture by using just PowerPoint? In this video, I'm going to show you an example of how you can create your own professional 3D illusion picture by using just Microsoft PowerPoint. But hey, if we're just meeting, my name is Gary. My passion is helping you with the best tips and tools for building your influence through online video. If this is your first time visiting my channel or this is the first time you were watching this video, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Alright, let's get started. Hi, today I'm going to teach you something special by making this picture into something like this by using just Microsoft PowerPoint. Okay, let's get started. For this example, I'm going to use this guy over here. I'll leave the download link in the description below. Click on free download. And there you go. This is the picture that we want. Okay, now open up PowerPoint. Next, you need to delete all this text box. Then put the guy's picture inside. Now, we are going to remove the background by using just PowerPoint. First, click on Format and then click on Remove Background. PowerPoint will highlight the areas to be removed in magenta. You will need to highlight this inner rectangle so that it fits this guy's total height. Let's say I'm gonna pull it up to here. Okay, that looks perfectly fine. If some of the places that you want was marked to be removed, you can click on this and just draw on the place you want to keep and click on mark areas to remove to remove the area that you don't want. Next, click on keep changes. There you have it, an object with a background removed. Next, click on design, click on format background and set the color to solid fill and then choose the color that you want. For this instance, I'll choose this color, blue gray text 2. Alright, this is what we get. Next, click on insert shapes, click on triangle. Now, you need to drag the triangle by clicking shift, I mean holding the shift button. Okay, once that is done, click on right click, format shape until you get this. Next, for the fill option, you want to click on no fill. Then click on the line, change the width to somewhere around 15, and then change the color to white. Next, you will want to rotate this triangle to the position you want. Let's say this. Okay, as you can see, it's not 3D yet, but we'll get into it. Click on right click, click copy, delete this, and then right click anywhere, click on this, paste as a picture. In fact, you will have to paste twice. Okay, once this is done, position this triangle into the middle, click on Format, under Arrange, click on Selection Pane. Okay, now, once this is highlighted, click on Crop, I'll crop this into half of the triangle, click on Crop again. Okay, once this is done, Position the second triangle and make sure it aligns perfectly to the second triangle. Now click on the triangle and right click, send to back. There you have it. Now I'm going to teach you how to save as picture. Press on file, save as document, click on this. The file type, click 
click on JPEG or PNG based on your preference. I'll click on PNG this time. I'll save this file as 3D image. Just this one. And we are done. There, there you have it. Here you can crop it to square if you want to make it look nicer. Hey, I'm glad you made it this far for this video. Don't forget to subscribe and click on the notification bells. I'll see you in the next one.